we have been to great lengths to resolve this case in the least disruptive manner possible. Up until the last, we tried every way we could to encourage Lazaro Gonzalez to voluntarily hand over the child to his father. Unfortunately, the Miami relatives rejected our efforts, leaving us no other option but the enforcement action. This has been a very emotional case for everyone involved. The most important thing is that Ileon is safe and that no one was seriously hurt. As we all await the outcome of the appellate process, I think it is important for us all to accept Ileon's long overdue reunion with his father. It is time to heal wounds that have divided the community. It is time to help this little boy heal from the tra tragedies that he has experienced. One of the beauties of television is that it shows exactly what the facts are. And as I understand it, if you look at it carefully, it shows that the gun was pointed to the side and that the finger was not on the trigger. It is important in these situations to look carefully and to understand the facts and to understand that we had received information that there were guns perhaps in the crowd, perhaps in the house. It was unclear but that the safety of all involved was paramount. And when law enforcement goes into a situation like that, it must go in prepared for the unexpected. The conversation goes along the lines of, uh, this may seem very scary right now, but it will soon be better. We're taking you to see your papa. He calls him papa. Um, you will not be going back to Cuba. You will not be on a boat. You are around people who care for you. We are going to take care of you. Please don't be frightened, that kind of a conversation. He had followed it carefully. I think uh, we had briefed him uh, yesterday afternoon at 445, told him about the ongoing negotiations. I had had a chance to talk to him coming back from Oklahoma City. Uh, we talked about the developments as of about 8 o'clock last night, and then this morning uh, he expressed satisfaction over the manner in which it had been carried out.